Orlin, I'm filming, okay? I'm actually not very happy right now. This holiday season, come treat yourself and join my Patreon. You'll get tons of mukbangs and other content not allowed on YouTube. It makes a great Christmas present. Must be age 18 or older, link below. You know, I'm watching a video that Orlin put on his channel about a year ago, or I don't even know when he posted that, maybe half a year ago. And it's called like, Nikocado before the mukbangs. And I just watched it and, you know, like, there were, things were so different. I mean, I don't know what happened other than me getting overweight, you know, getting fat. I really feel like the food I eat does contribute to how I think. This is something that I've been experiencing for years, doing bug bugs how I eat stuff and then it makes me angry or I eat stuff and then it makes me confused or I eat stuff and it makes me furious or mean. I mean, I I literally just woke up. Well, not just woke up, I've been up, been up for a couple hours and I woke up in fury. Why do I wake up in fury? I used, I was just watching this video. I used to wake up with a smile. I used to jump out of bed when the sun came out and I listened to the birds and I would go pick bananas. I would eat them and be happy. <laughs> and am I happy now? I mean, I feel a lot more full. My stomach doesn't feel empty, but I'm hungry now and I look like a freaking piece of bowling. I look like a bowling ball. I am so round. I look like a lump of coal. I look like a pile of dog crap. The owner of my relationship. <laughs> In honor of my relationship. <laughs> you know, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm actually like, I'm, you know, I, I, I am lucky. <laughs> I, I am lucky. I would be done with this bunk bunk channel <clears throat> because I eat a healthy, but I eat very healthy and balanced, but it's not balanced enough. I don't know. So I woke up so angry today and I was so mean to Orlin and I didn't want to be mean to Orlin. I just, I wasn't like, like crazy, like violent or hitting him or anything. No, 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 no. It was just like, I wake up, I'm like, why did you take out the trash? Do the dishwasher. Like I was just bossy and also I was just like, I woke up so upset with myself. And I looked at myself in the mirror and I said, ew. I looked at myself in the mirror and I said, that's hideous with five S's. I don't know why, and no one talks about this in society. No one ever talks about this. Do you realize nobody talks about how food makes you think differently? No one. I don't, I never heard this at church. I never heard this at school. I never heard this in university. I never heard this from my parents. I never heard this from my friends. Barely, maybe one or two of them that were like gluten free because their joints stop swelling when they stop eating gluten. But you're just like, oh, oh, well that's just them because they have a gluten tolerance. But me, I'm fine. No, I'm not fine. I'm not fine. I'm not fine. I'm not fine. I am not fine. I am not, 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 not fine. I am not okay at all. <coughs> I feel like the food that I eat is really contributing to a lot of my madness. 
And I've always kind of known this. I've always, I mean, I've always known, but it's just like I'm experiencing it so often where I just wake up in a fury or I wake up and I'm sad. Like yesterday, I remember waking up and I was, I can't even say the word on YouTube, it starts with a D, ends in Eschen. You know, it's a little, little, little go. And I'm like, why? What do I have to be sad about? My belly's full, I still have my apartment, I'm still with Orlin, even though we don't get along like we used to. And my belly's full, I have all these followers, my social media's doing fine, it's doing really good, you know? I'm getting all these subs, all these views every month, like, why do I have to be sad about? And I wake up so sad, like, my world's over. And I'm like, why do I have to, no one teaches you this, no one talks about this, no one even emphasizes it. The doctors don't tell you, the nurses don't tell you, school teachers don't tell you, no one tells you this. And yeah, you're. it's just one of those things that's kind of like, they know it, but they, it's not actually registering every day. <clears throat> and I don't know what to eat. <laughs> I don't know what to eat. In this video that I just watched, I was eating lots of fruit. I was eating only fruits. And you know, I felt happier, but I also, it was so hard to eat enough, you know? I was blending all these smoothies. I was doing like, I was shoving in so much fruit. We used to buy cases and cases and cases and cases. Oh my gosh, it's just it's just annoying to have to eat that much. I mean, yeah, I overeat now, but it's just like, at every meal, you have to aim for a thousand calories. It's just crazy. So today, this video will be, it will be a little zucchini pasta salad with avocado and mango dressing. And um, a little date date sandwich made out of celery sticks because I really need to get healthy and some lime squirted on the zucchini and maybe we'll throw in some extra fruits in there you know I want to I want to see how I feel again so today's video is gonna be very healthy it's gonna be I need to I need to feel health you know in my mind not I mean let, who cares about the body the body it'll shrink and expand that's what they do that's what they're made to do that's what they can do it's not like we're a bird where we gain an ounce of fat and we pass away. No, we're allowed, we can get really fat. You know, Mr. Noodle, my parrot, could not get fat. We can get, oh yes, we can get really fat. It's gonna be a lot of greenery. It's gonna have avocados. It's gonna have fruits. It's gonna be um, a big spread. I have my tray, welcome to my video. Thank you. This tray, I mean, I smashed this tray on my head. Look, I bent it, I broke it because I went like this on my head. I flung it into the ceiling. I mean, I have, Look at my tread, that's an indication of how mad I've gotten. I've gone mad that I've ripped every all the Teflons off. <sighs> um, anyways, we're gonna put zucchini pasta on here. And we're gonna have tomatoes, cherry tomatoes, avocados, made out of zucchini noodles. We're gonna spiralize it. It's gonna be raw. We're not even gonna cook it. And um, this is what I'm gonna be having today in honor of my past. We're gonna try this for a, a week. One week of health, and I will report back to you how I feel. I know in the first two, well, I might be a little hungry at first. As long as I eat enough, that's fine, but um, it's still different. Like, you can eat, you know, 5,000 calories of these fruits, and you're still gonna be like, oh my god, I feel, you know, it's withdrawal, you know. <clears throat> um, so I will be right back, and I will report to you about how healthy I feel after this meal. So here we go. Let's go get all my ingredients. It's just water, you newt. And yes, I put makeup on my cheese mind, so don't question it. Anyways, I need to be a little more serious. You guys, this video is so exciting. Shh. I said, shh. You guys, maybe uh -huh. I like it. One of these, I have lots, okay? <laughs> I said, shh. Spaghettios. It worked. I also veganized the pot. <laughs> the pot's vegan now. That's the magic word to make things vegan. You guys. Today I am doing a special ramen noodle. It's just water weight. Confused. <laughs> <laughs> that I used to do with Mr. Noodle, my parrot. If I have a breakdown in this video, that's why. So, well, Orlin ate all of them. When I went to Thailand to cheat on him, he ate all the, oh, 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 honey, it's true, and I'm proud of it. The way he's been treating me lately, oh, girl. Uh, these are exclusive. These came all the way from Korea. They don't make them anymore. These, uh, I don't even, I don't even, well, I'm gonna 
save these five until my last mukbang on YouTube, which is coming out when I turn 30. I'm gonna quit mukbangs, and I'll do one final hoorah. And that last big old meal for YouTube will be these noodles. This was Mr. Noodle's favorite noodle. Um, I don't know why. I think the color is very, very red. It has like a sharp red color, like very red. It's a spicy seafood noodle. It's called uh, gojong. Uh, no, but I just say on here in English. It's not jampong. It's like chew. I don't. I, I know. I'm not even gonna try because people are gonna think I'm making fun of the language. I'm not. I just don't remember. Uh, I don't remember how to say this. If you're Korean, please let us know in the comments. It's really not hard, that hard to say. I don't feel like looking at like look, I don't feel like looking it up. You guys, I had to wait over six weeks to get this delivered from South Korea. They no longer make them. Someone had them. Spicy, by Samyang too. Oh. So what happened was I ordered big old boxes over three years ago when I lived in Colombia. I ordered these big boxes of noodles that came from Asia. They shipped them to America, and then I had the America shipped to Colombia. And in that box, there were big boxes. There were like five or six of these. I did one with Orland. Nick, maybe we can put it in the little thumbnail. Oh, uh, look how skinny I was. Okay, and recently I got in a fight with Orland and I was shown before and after of how angry I was versus the nice clip. So Nick, when you're editing this, perhaps put in a little bit for their enjoyment. A little preview of what this looked like. If you guys want to see the full version, I'll link it down below. And if I forget, just type in Nick Akato spicy seafood noodles with Orland. And it should come out. We're both wearing blue shirts. We're, we're trying to redo the thumbnail, except we probably both can't fit with our double chins. Like, look at my double chin. Girl, let's put it side by side. Hi. Hi, Nick, side by side. Hey, edit in that side by side. Here we go. Hi. And I looked at the camera with my eyelashes. I was like, <laughs> I look hideous. Hideous with five S's. Hideous. That's okay, it's just water. Um, it will melt away once I stop eating salt because it's just salt. Anyways, let's get started. I'm talking too much. But this is going down memory lane for me. I'm wearing the same shirt like I said. Oh, I miss my bird. So Mr. Needle was a talking parrot, if you don't remember. Actually, let's put some water. Let's get this cooking. Let's get this party started. So here we go. Um, is this enough water? We don't want to do too much water. Well, no, last time I didn't do enough. Did I strain out the water? Did I strain it out? Let's see what the directions say before I decide how much water. This is what it looks like. The seafood noodles. Oh my god. I haven't even looked at these or smelled these for three years. It's my baby noodle. Okay, they look like any other Samyang noodle. Nice and thick, nice and curly. Smells like salt for my water weight. Okay, but let's look at the pouch. Okay, so it has the little seafood dehydrated sea seaweed, and then it has the spicy noodle sauce. Oh my God, my baby noodle. Does it have a scent? No, you can't really smell it. I'm gonna cry in this video. I miss my bird. He was a talking Amazon. He was green. He used to sit on my shoulder and eat. He loved, this was his favorite, and I only did it once or twice, because when I went to Orl when I went to Thailand to cheat on my husband, Orlin, he used to eat the new box of noodles because he missed me. That was the only thing that he could think of. Like, you know, it made him feel a little comfort to eat the noodles because that's why I had been eating before I left to go to Thailand. Long story short, I got to pour it. I couldn't go back to Colombia. I didn't want to live in the United States. I couldn't afford it. So I went to the United States. A viewer of mine paid for my plane ticket. All I had to do was cover rent, and rent there is pretty cheap. So, anyways, long story short, uh, Orlin ate like all the rest with Mr. Noodle, and they ate it every day thinking of me. Mr. Noodle missed me, Orlin missed me, and I was just busy cheating. So, um, anyways, we're gonna put this in with this. So, do I cook in the spice? Hey, Orlin, what? I have a question for you. Because well, it doesn't even have the English version on here, so I don't remember. Because some things are better cooked in, some things are better strained and added, some things. Well, we're not gonna run cold water on it, that could ruin it. I don't remember what I did, I'm sure. Well, Orlin might remember because he's the one who ate this so much. So let's see what he says. That's wrong now. So I have a question for you. So when you used to do this with Mr. Noodle, yes. did you cook it straight out the water and then add the sauce in and mix it around? Or did you cook it with the sauce? I never strained it. You never strained it? No. Did you? Well, I only started straining noodles very recently. No, I've always strained noodles. Oh, well, no. I've no. done strained noodles. The difference is I tried running cold water under mm -hmm. them for certain things. Like the judging monk tastes better when the noodles are cold and then 
They don't taste good hot. Some things it depends because the noodles get chewier. Well, from what I well, I used to not. I didn't never made these like this. I would just eat the cups with this. The cups. Oh, okay. Which tastes identical, but those you leave the water in. You leave the water in. Yeah. You guys, we don't know how to be cooks, and we can't read Korean. Well, thank you for your. I'm trying to have it in English. No, they don't. I just looked. They don't have any English. Why can't you be perfect? Shh. I'm not perfect. Here we go. Perfect people can speak all languages. I can't. I'm going to hell. All right, so it doesn't really say. Um, I think in Colombia I cooked it all in, didn't I? I'm sure I did, so. Didn't I? I never strained that. Do we even have a colander in Colombia? We got a colander. So we did strain sometimes. I would strain it, but leave some fluid, and then add the sauce maybe. Okay. Let's start the party. Let's get the water started. So we need enough to, so we're both full. So I'm thinking eight packs, we each eat four. That should be good. Because we're gonna fill up this pizza, this pizza pan. So let's start opening while this is boiling. Let's talk about my bird. Actually, let's talk about my cramps. My cramps are getting out of control. Also, I feel like I have a blood clot. <laughs> Sometimes I wish my death But it goes away if I have cotton candy. I don't know, I have a little cotton candy, it goes away and I feel healthy. You guys, look, I mean, I know I'm joking around, I'm such a troll, but in all seriousness, I did get blood work recently with Orlet, and I don't have high cholesterol because I have fruits and vegetables. Three days, and there's a spider up there. I don't know why there's spiders in this place. That's disgusting. Well, good thing we're being evicted. Ugh. All right, so we're like this. Ooh. Oh. Here we go. Put that in like this. Okay, so, I mean, I would think to cook it in because it has these dehydrated little flakes. So anyways, I just kind of want to eyeball, I'm pretty sure eight is enough. This, I kind of want to open it in a nice way. Let's oh, see, these plastics don't open nicely. Yeah. Oh, this is so old school. This is probably a couple of years old. Ramen does not go bad before you say you're eating expired ramen. This won't go bad, I swear. Did you guys have a nice Thanksgiving? I posted a one hour vlog for my Patreons. So, if you follow my Patreon, patreon.com slash me, well, just click the link down below. Um, and you have to be 18 years or older to follow there. Just saying, I won't let you in. And I mean it, I don't even want you watching my YouTube video if you're, oh, ooh, they're very messy. I don't even want you, I don't even want you watching my channel if you're not 18, what are you doing here? Ugh, so, ugh, I don't like to think about kids on my channel. Um, anyways, well, long story short, I made a Patreon vlog about Thanksgiving, so if you want to be thankful, you can support my channel, where I get to monetize for being non-advertising or friendly, and, you know, help me continue this train wreck, thank you. But you get a lot of it, you get some videos, that's all I'm going to say. Anyways, I posted that, I hope you had a nice Thanksgiving. My Thanksgiving was pretty good. All I did was eat. I didn't cry. I didn't even fight with Orland. It was a good Thanksgiving. No fighting. Ooh, this got a little funny. Ooh. I don't like when they get smashed. It's probably because, oh, you know what? I did fight with Orland. I did throw these across the room and I was very upset because I had to wait forever. And these were not cheap. Like if you bought this regularly when they were like in season, <gasps> look at all those crumbs. Um, these would have been like four dollars, five dollars, forty dollars, ridiculous. Ooh. So I don't care if this gets no views. This is for my heart, my talking parrot. I love this, and you know this was Orleans comfort food when I cheated. So I cheated. I, I it was an accident. It was not. I didn't have him. He was not in my mind. Let's just say I was. Well, clearly. <laughs> He, it was not with Orlin in mind. Like, how can I make him feel bad today? I just did it because I, I don't know. It was their fault. They made me do it. It was their fault. It wasn't mine. Is this enough? Is this enough noodles? Probably. I think so. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's do eight. Because I'm really hungry. I am hungry, so we're gonna do eight. I think eight should be a nice number. All right, so I feel like we can put the noodles in now, right? Should we add, well, I don't know what to do. 
I don't know if I cook these. I don't know if I strain these. I really don't know. It doesn't say. I'm sure there's no difference between straight. The difference is when you run cold water under it. Okay, let's just let's just go to town. Here we go. Put this in like this. Happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> I know it was a couple days ago, but um, yeah. And now we're in the Christmas holiday shopping spirit. But I did see an, uh, something on the news saying that this Black Friday is gonna be like no other Black And if you're watching this in the future, we had the you know what, the pandemic this year, so, and it's still not, no one knows what's, it's been almost one year since it got kind of like released in the US. So anyways, um, I mean, I don't go out on Black Shark Show. Every, every time there's Black Friday, I always talk about on my YouTube channel, I like to spread awareness and say that's not a very good thing to do. Like, Jesus, Mary and Joseph. I get we're all struggling. I mean, people are really struggling now too. That's, it's gonna be very ironic, you know, people are gonna be like, catching it, not wearing masks, stampeding over each other, or who knows what's gonna happen. Meanwhile, to save money, because they need to save money, because no one has money right now. And I don't have money because I just spent $40 per pack on these exclusive, no longer produ produced noodles. So look what I'm doing. This is probably not the way to do it. I'm trying to like get them a little bit soft so I can bend them. Yeah, because this doesn't heat up too much by like cooking in front of you. See, in a dream life, I would cook in the kitchen, but the kitchen is messy. I like to have a nice clean background so I can mess it up when I throw the food. <laughs> okay, we like to mess it up. Yes, we do. This is not enough water. This is definitely not enough water, but we're gonna put this in anyway. Um, so I'm so excited to eat this. Yes, I am. This is how I cook. I'm a terrible chef. People, Nick, you need to cook more. Nick, you don't cook enough. Nick, you don't do enough. I'm a I hate cooking. This is the extent of it, and I'm already frustrated because it's not working fast enough. I'm already frustrated. Work faster. I just want to be like, work faster. I'm hungry. Cook faster. Cook faster. I'm hungry. Oh. It's broken. I, I give up. I'm going to McDonald's. That's why I say I'm going to McDonald's because this is not working fast enough. Sheepers, creepers. Ugh. There's not enough water. We have to put a little bit more. And it's not hot enough. If I did this in the kitchen, it would be really fast. Let me go to the kitchen. I feel like this is going to take forever. Yeah, let me go to the kitchen. And just cook this till it's good. Actually, no, they're softening up. Never mind. Okay, so these are the noodles. Ooh. Remember I told you about that um, advertisement here on YouTube? It's for Nordstrom Rack. Such a catchy, I already talked about this though, but such a catchy song. I love hearing it, but I'm so disappointed by the visual. They wasted such a good tune on a horrible visual. No one knows, you have to like rewind and think about it to be able to know what they played in front of your face. Rack is bigger than the word Nordstrom. No one knows what Rack is, I'm telling you. I'm telling you, they, that was a missed opportunity. They could have had the best Christmas advertisement ever with that jingle. The holidays are coming. Show someone that you care. Such a good one. So catchy. The girl, the woman's voice is nice. It's a great video. Okay, so this is working. This is working, you guys. This is working. So let me get my, um, let's open up all these little things. Put these in. Ooh. So we got some onions. Put that in there just like that, yep. Look at these. These are dehydrated vegetables. Oh wait, is this the squid? What is this? Oh, it's like it's like soy, like pretend fish. <laughs> yes, so healthy. Let's eat some pretend fish today. Nick, what'd you have for uh, today? I had some scrambled eggs. Had an avocado and some pretend fish. Yep. What'd you have today? Oh, I had some, you know, a peanut butter jelly sandwich. I had a slice of pizza and some pretend fish. Here we go. Look at all this pretend fishies. Here we go. 
pretend. I just did a squat, ouch my knees. I literally just felt like I was doing the I did the, I forget what the exercise is called, but you put a, like a bar behind you with weights on it and you, you squat. Oh, squats. I used to do squats, I used to go to a gym. I used to have the most beautiful butt. I can't go into detail, YouTube just prohibits it, but follow my Patreon. Um, oh my God, it was so nice. Now it's a block of cottage cheese and it won't even grow. That's the crazy part, it won't even grow. Everything else grows but that, but the butt. Okay, so this is good. Oh, this is perfect. Perfect, now let's do the sauce. My baby noodle. Ooh. Oh. Oh my God, it tastes so good. It's, oh. Okay, I, I remember what I did. I like to cook most of it and then I'll put the, yeah, I know what I'm gonna do. It tastes like seaweed, salty, spicy. So nice. So nice. Oh my God. <laughs> my cry. My bird. I couldn't bring him out of the um, Columbia. They wouldn't let me. And I don't even know it was Columbia's rule. I think the U.S. would have let me. Well, I don't know. I also don't know. That's crazy because I could bring my sloth from Florida to Colombia, but I couldn't bring the sloth back to the United States because once it's in, it's in. Yeah, Colombia is very strict with that. We actually talked to them about getting papers and know what they said? Literally the lady at the airport who works for the airport, she's like, yeah, you could have the papers and we could still deny you. It's up to us. We're like, why would, it was like $5,000 for all these fancy permits. This is Colombia where people don't make that in a year. Well, maybe they'll make that in a year. That's it, you know, they, they can't afford that. I mean, just crazy. Okay, so this looks like it's done. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Just a small tidbit of water. That's it, that's it, that's it. Just enough. Now let's get this ready, all this off the table. And we're gonna mix the sauce in together. I will be right back. Okay. Oh, I could have actually put that in, well, whatever. <laughs> I could have put that in there. Oh my God, I'm so excited. This is gonna be so delicious. It already is very red, considering that was one pack. Wow. Okay, here we go. Um, ooh, pick my nose. Uh. Ooh. Get that, get the fake fish, get the pretend fish. Thank you, there it is. Get the pretend fish out of here. All the pretend fish in the house. All the pretend fish in the house. Pretend fish, pretend fish. Okay. Hey, Orlin. Okay, I need your help, please, while I start making this. I'm doing this for the people on camera. Don't want this. Okay, so this is what it looks like. I don't know if you can see. <gasps> Ooh. <gasps> Pretend fish. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Look at this. <gasps> Ooh. All right, so let me take this off. Yeah, I will be right back. Ooh. Yeah. Take this, please. Okay. Ooh. And then take the wop, the wop, and give me some scissors too, please. Okay, I'll just get the scissors. I got the scissors. Okay, so I'm gonna put this down just a little bit so you can see what I'm doing. Because I care about your visualness. Okay. Take the wok, please, and take the picture, please. Okay. Orlin, it tastes so good. It, it tastes just like seaweed. Ooh, I look like a blueberry. I look like a blueberry too. Can I take the one? Actually, we might need to add, well, I'll leave it. just in case. But take all the trash off. Including you? 
I'm such a bossy boob. And uh, so you're gonna have to stuff that one and add three to that one. All these blue bags are trash? Yes, we, we don't need them. Oh, it smells so good. I like you. Okay. What's more important than the trash is stuffing the bag. I like to have a nice little visual. Oh, it smells so, it is very, the pigmentation on this is amazing. It's so, oh my God, this is gonna be so tasty. I can't wait, Mr. Noodle. My baby. This is my baby. Okay, can you even see? It's a big old plate over here. Whew. Okay. We're gonna do all the spice because it's not even that okay. spicy. Stuff that one and stuff this one, please. Oh, he brought me spinach. Put it in the vegetables so you can look. Oh. So you want me to stuff these? In, back there so they can't hear it. Because okay. they have to hear my voice. Oh my God, I'm so excited. We have two more left. Oh, this is gonna be so good. And you better not say it's too spicy. Everything's too spicy for Orlin. Too spicy, too spicy. Last time he dumped all this, uh, whatchamacallit, he dumped all of this, what's that called? Sesame seed, or yeah, sesame seed sauce. Ooh, sesame seed oil. Sesame seed oil. I'll do it outside. Thank you. Queen of not noticing things, he just spilled all the sauce there. I didn't do anything. Yeah, you did. You put the uh, crumble, those greens. Can you use human words? You put a bowl of heavy greens on top of a little pack of noodles and it squirted. I'm not sorry. Okay. Okay, you guys, look. Ooh. Mr. Noodle, I miss you. Baby, look at this. Look. Look at this. Look. Look at me. Look at me. A man child. Look at me. Oh, nice. Look at me. Very nice. Look at me. You want a medal for that? Oh my god, yes. Okay, I will be right back. We're gonna start the show. Hi. Hi. Okay, so I'm so excited. Here's a bowl for Orlin. We are so hungry. <laughs> yes. Always hungry. And we didn't fight during this video. Uh, we fought before the video, but not during this video. We've been good. Yes, yes, remember. <laughs> I'm like, remember, remember your lines. Remember, you've been great. Everything's wonderful. Thank you. He's oh, been so, so polite today. It looks so good. It makes me think of my baby noodle. Ooh. Oh, he used to, he used to love. Oh, it's still steaming. He used to love eating these noodles. He would actually stick his whole face into the the ramen cup and uh, just. I'll just serve you first. He should always serve me first. Oh, yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Now, this is not that spicy, so you should be able to take it really good. <laughs> I, ha I, I usually take it really good, but sometimes it's too much, and I don't take it that good. Ooh, this is for Orlin. That's a really big bowl yeah. for Orlin. Okay. Well, I can take it pretty big, you know, like, this is a pretty big bowl. You don't take me very good, and I'm big. Well, that's too big. Ooh, yay. I like being too big. Okay, so this is what it looks like. You're definitely too big in every sense of the word. I'm skinny, and let's not start in this video. Yeah, it's like skinny fat. What do you mean skinny fat? You're skinny fat. What? You're skinny fat. Skinny fat is when you are skinny but fat. I'm not, I'm just fat. I'm not no, skinny. but you are skinny. Where? In... What part of me is skinny? Your brain. Don't start without me. Okay. Why don't we do this? Orlin, we're supposed to be nice in this video. Okay. Oh, uh, and it's gonna be all cold now. Orlin got me some greens. I got you greens because I have to keep you alive until your 30th birthday, which I don't think is gonna be possible at the rate you're eating. Why do you care? You're so, you don't even care about me. All right, so this is what it looks like. Mr. Noodle, my baby, we're eating your, Mr. Noodle would be ashamed of your behavior. If you... Mr. Noodle would be eating and we would still be bickering. <laughs> I know. We never used to be bickering. be eating. She, people will be like, I'm Noodle. And like in the comments, be like, I'm Noodle. I'm Noodle. I'm noodle. Be, like, I'm Noodle. Noodle, Noodle. Just like, here, here for Noodle. <gasps> look how, look at this. That's a lot. Wow. I'm just gonna start. Cheers to my baby, Mr. Noodle. Mr. Noodle loves ramen. I like big mouthfuls. Here we go. I don't like big mouthfuls. Mmm. Mm. Good. Mmm. Oh my God. Mmm. 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 The 
holidays are here and 2020 has been rough. So I'm going to make you a personalized eight minute long video on Cameo. Treat yourself or surprise someone else. It makes a great Christmas present. Link below. It's good. Don't touch me. It's really good. Mmm. It's good. <laughs> this is so... It has such good flavor and we don't even mm. like seafood. I like seafood. I don't like cooking it or smelling it. We don't like cooking anything. That's true. <clears throat> you know, one time in Colombia, he made, uh, what was it, a tortilla? No, a quesadilla. Mm -hmm. That was the first time I ever saw you cooking. I have to sneeze. Oh. Can you not do it on the food? Can you no, do it away from the food? I won't do it on the food. Well, the first I really time. have to sneeze. And sneeze, it's probably good for you. You're probably full of stuff all clogged up. Hey, hang on. Mmm. 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 It has such good flavor. Mmm. 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 And the noodles themselves are very high quality and they're kind of sweet. Mm. Kind of like the volcano fire noodles. Mmm. What do you think? Of, like, don't you think the noodles are actually pretty good? Yeah. And the flavor is really, really tasty. My baby noodle. Mm. <clears throat> I'm gonna knock, knock it down with some greens. <clears throat> you know, the, the nice thing about noodle is that not only would he eat ramen noodles, but he also loved eating healthy. Like, you could give him a piece of mango and he, would, he wouldn't even think about it, he would eat it. Not, Not me. Banana. I would think about it. Well, yeah, clearly he would think about it. You look like a blueberry. This, we're supposed to get along this video. No more insults, please. My new Walmart shirt. No. I just spilled noodle on my new Walmart shirt. That's not my problem. There we go. You can see I have my little blocks of cheese over here. Okay, you guys. This is so tasty. It's actually really I'm good. I'm gonna eat all of it. Bro, you need it. the calories. I do. This is so he good. He didn't eat much. Imagine today. this with cheese. We don't have to imagine. Should I bring some cheese? You wanna put cheese on? Cheesy seafood? Is that a thing? We can make it a thing. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's be naughty. Mmm. The noodles are perfect. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Don't eat all the noodles. I'm going to eat as much as I can. Eat the vegetables. I would do a combination of both. Guys, this is so good. I know, it's so good. Oh my god, why do they have to be so expensive? If you guys want to come buy You just can't buy these anywhere. You just can't. You can't get these anywhere, you guys. They're so good. Ah, this is my favorite ramen noodle. They don't make it anymore. I think it's because I think I'm Mr. Mr. Noodle. The noodles are perfect. They're gummy. They're chewy. Not too dry. Not too moist. I did a noodle video recently, and the noodles were too slimy. Mmm. This is perfect. 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 <laughs> My baby. I'm sorry, we keep talking about Mr. 